Sutton Foster, Charity Hope Valentine. I love I love hearing all those names together. How I exciting! Know, I know it's insanity. It's it's exciting. It's totally exciting. So uh, Lee said you had a dream to play this role, and then you actually went to her and said, "I want to play this role." When did that dream start? Oh God! You know, people always ask me in interviews. They're like, "Is there a role that like you have a dream role?" and for some reason, Charity, even though I don't, like I didn't really know the show, I think I just knew, ooh, Shirley MacLaine played that part, so maybe that would be a fun role to play. Um, I, I would always say Charity. And um, and then we got approached because of that, honestly, because I, I had been saying it in, in interviews, we got approached with the rights to it. So if you say it in interviews, it comes true? It, it does, Paul. It you does. want to say something else right now? Do <laughs> you, you want to plan your next job? Or? <laughs> Look, give me, give me a second. I'll think of something. But no, that's literally how it happened. And so we got approached with the rights up for it. And I was like, what? And um, I immediately called Lee. Because Lee and I work together on Violet. She's become one of my dearest friends. I think she's a genius. She's, I, you know, she really um, understands story and and she's just a real um, actor's director. Yeah. And I just, uh, she's like a, a true collaborator. And I, um, so I went to her and she was like, okay. And then we went to the new group and, you know, I, I, we knew we wanted to do it. Um, uh, sort of in a new way, yeah. uh, not not commercially, kind of a little off the radar, a little mm -hmm. sort of like how do we uh, rediscover it in yeah. 2016? And this is what well, we've come up with. So well, because it has a real like Broadway razzle dazzle on top of it. Like when you think of it, you think of a big musical comedy. So you, you want to like strip that down. Well, we want to strip it down because this world that Charity lives in is she creates razzle dazzle, but the world that she lives in. Is pretty rough, right. you know? It's pretty down and dirty. And she's kind of a stripper. She's, yeah, well, yeah, yeah, she is a stripper. Yeah. She's a, she dances with strangers for money. <laughs> it's not, yeah. it's not, you know, right. it's it's pretty rough. Um, and she's like, want, she's trying to find a, a man to basically save her. It's pretty sad. Yeah. And so we're really wanting to like reveal that side of it as opposed to it seeming like, Oh, this girl's got everything. It's like, this girl's got nothing. There's got to be something better than this. Great song, by the way. Great song, great <laughs> moment. So it's like we really want to sort of show like what that other side is. So that's why it's kind of, it's really exciting the way that the stage is. I mean, we're basically the stage is the, is the Fandango Ballroom and everything is kind of, you know, coming from that world. And, and it's all about the relationship that that these women have, you know. And, and what's kind of cool is that at the new group where we're performing, we all share a dressing room. Oh. And, I, I, and I was like... You're excited about that. I'm kind of excited. I haven't <laughs> done that in a long time. And it's like so much about the show is about these women and these relationships and, and how they've created this family. And, you know, these are, these are women who, you know, these are women who are rough around the edges and who have had to make some pretty... Um, uh, you know, hard choices. And so for your leading man, you thought, you know who I want to fall in love with on stage? The monster from Young Frankenstein. <laughs> sure, Hensley. <laughs> well, what amazing, what amazing casting, right? Yeah. He's, when Lee was like, what do you think of Schuler? <laughs> I was like, I love Schuler. <laughs> I was like, Schuler's perfect. And it's great for audiences to see him do something like this, yeah. you know? He's a brilliant actor and a big old goofball. And, um, like you. It, just like me. What about working with uh, Josh on this choreography? Well, I have to say that um, uh, I don't think I've... People are like, when's the last time you danced like this? And I was like, I've never danced like this. Well, I remember saying that about Anything Goes, but you're saying this is actually... No, this is different. This is a lot... This is harder. I mean, I'm still a good... Thank God Charity's a clown, so I can still be a bit of a clown. But, um, but I'm definitely doing things I've never done. Or maybe that I did when I was 16, but I ain't 16 anymore. There's a, I mean, and I think there's something kind of exciting about playing this character at 41 years old, too. There's something kind of sad about it. You know, she's still holding on to such hope. But Josh is, you know, Josh has, um, he probably has the hardest job. You know, it's so much, so much of this, uh, it's so iconic. And what I love about him is that he's breathing fresh new life into it, but also honoring what has been done before. I mean, some of these, and we haven't cut any of the dance music. Um, some of these dance numbers are like really long. <laughs> I was like, this is endless, it keeps going. But it's also like, 
overwhelming and so exciting. We just put brass band together um, last week, and at the end of it, I was like, <laughs> I'm, A, my head's gonna explode because I'm so out of breath, but it's just so like overwhelming to be able to do these iconic, you know, classic numbers. And, um, and people are gonna be sitting three feet from you. People are gonna be sitting three feet from us. And our sweat's gonna be like, Free sweat, like, free sweat with your ticket free purchase. Sweat. It's like a boxing, you know, boxing <laughs> rink. <laughs> like sweat and tears, like flinging around. I've never done anything like this. I've never been in the round before. Yeah. So nobody knows what you look like from behind. No one knows what I look like from behind. <laughs> it's not as well, actually it's a little more exciting than the front, but 